Hi everyone, I hope you are all well. So this is the video about talking about how you can develop your ideas uh, throughout the week. I used the term, I think, a little bit before composition. And have to be careful using that word because, at least for me, there's a lot of connotation about what that means in music. I have this idea of somebody sitting at a desk and writing music. And that's not really what I'm talking about here. What I'm talking about is just letting yourself go and letting yourself express yourself. And sure, there's some techniques that you can use, but by and large, this is just fueled by just allowing the flow to come through you, just like you breathe air and let it out, just like you open your mouth and sing. And I don't mean to make that overly simplistic, but it is really important to make the point that that is what the emphasis is on, just letting your body as a musical instrument express itself. So, we talked about the numbers giving some type of structure and that there's an order going from 1 through the 10. And that's great. Uh, I think now the next stage is really to develop these musically. And one of the best ways to do that, um, for a couple of reasons, is to go to vowel sounds. One, because there's no thinking about words, um, which is good when we're trying to develop the music. And two, because they're they open the voice and they allow uh, it to ring and they also allow us to produce sound in an easier and less tense way. Consonants bring in the tongue and all sorts of potential tensions in the jaw and whatnot. So just simply an ah, ah, it's kind of free um, and, and, and simple. So yeah, one thing that's coming up for me at the moment is that we haven't talked a lot about vocal technique. And I'm wary of that. And I was wary actually in the last um, session that we did when some of you performed it and weren't so happy with what you were doing, even though musically speaking it had a lot of potential. I felt that afterwards maybe that was because the actual singing of it might not have been very enjoyable if there was some tension. Um, so that's a whole nother area talking about vocal technique and it's an area that I'm still really a student of. So I think it's just important maybe to outline at this point before we go into this exercise once again that the exercise is to allow us to just express ourselves freely. We're not necessarily trying to produce big sounds or small sounds, just like you would have a conversation with somebody on the street and talk in a natural way. That's what I'm trying to evoke in this exercise, just a natural expression, free of all of the kind of ideas about how we should sing or what way we should sing. And with that on one hand, on the other hand, I would just say that um, with regards to technique, something that does not work to our favor vocally is when we're pushing the sound and throwing a lot of air at it. And a lot of the times that can come about when we have an insecurity about a high note. And so we go to a known territory a known territory and we just push at it just in fear and yeah that takes a quite a long time to just build the find the placement which is healthy and good um, and to keep practicing it and to trust it and you really need expertise there um, and somebody who really knows what they're doing so whilst that may not be everybody's interest I think it's worth pointing out. Just be careful not to push the sound by giving it too much um, in this exercise uh, when we're exploring it. So 
I've talked for five minutes, which is quite unbelievable. <laughs> but I think that there's important things in there. For the next five minutes, I'm not going to talk. I'm going to give an example of how you might explore this exercise. Don't try to um, get caught on what I'm doing or how I'm doing it or any of that stuff, but more on just this process of letting ourselves um, go. Okay. with all your process of music making and creativity. I look forward to hearing them all. One thing I will also say, uh, as a response to this video, please feel free to upload something um, and during the week and I will um, listen to it and give you some feedback and it'll be open to the group. I think we uh, might be encouraging and interesting and sparking our curiosity um, listening to one another um, as we sing. Okay, there's a 10 minute limit on my upload here, so I've got 50 seconds left. What else can I say to you? Yeah, this is not about doing it right. This is not about um, sounding wonderful, but that's nice too. Um, it's just about kind of Singing for the sake of singing, whatever that means to you. And just finding a space where you can really explore your voice and your love for singing. Who knows what will come out. But I feel like, as we've seen in these exercises, there's a way when we align with our innate musical instinct, the voice kind of follows. Okay, goodbye and enjoy.